Hello everyone, welcome to i3 Automations. Today I will show you two ways to get data from SS, SLC 500 to SSV file. So the two methods is very simple and you can see here step by step. First of all, you need, okay, you need connect to the PLC. It is if or online or offline is doesn't matter but uh, you need the first step that you I will show you right now you need go to the tools database ask to export and here you can make sure in the CSV tab you need make sure that the address symbol description is assigned and you can choose the path that you're gonna save so in this way I'm gonna save in desktop and hit OK and it is over there let's see what is happening with this file here double click in Excel so you can see we have the status the status we have the S2 S S so we have the all S tags but uh, we don't have the input output or binary or memory here and I will you you're gonna see why why we don't have the all of them here the IOs here the reason is because this this file this uh, this method the first method that I showed you is because we don't have description so if your program don't have description so in this way you cannot see nothing in the CSV file you need make sure that the PLC program has the all the comments and description for the tags so let's see the PLC side so let's see the input and you saw th that just three inputs we have over there so we have the these three inputs here and the rest we don't have comments here. so if you need if you need to see the all IOs that are used so you need put the comments you need add the comments and the PLC and in this way you can go and CSV file and you can see everything over there so let's do some example here let's let's see the i7 i7 slash 11 so we don't have a comment here but we're gonna add the comment right now let's see this is the test one the next one gonna be the text test two and the next gonna be test three just you see you can see that I add the comments in this tree here and I will do everything again so I gonna I gonna create a CSV file again and this tree that I added the comment you can see in the CSV file let's see let's check it out let's see again let's let's save the program upload the processor and let's you do again here the step by step again and you can you're gonna see the more three inputs that I added the comments over there so in this way you can see and the CSV file let's do again tools database ask to export and CSV hit OK and choose the path that you can save your CSV file okay desktop hit OK and let's see again so now you can see here okay we have the Excel file you see we have test 1, test 2 and test 3 this is that I added the comment so what we can learn from this is if, you, if your program has all tags has comment you can see all tags here in CSV file in an Excel file so but uh, if you if, if your program don't have comments so you cannot see and CSV file so 
before to do the, to do this make sure that your plc program has comments all right so the second method that i'm gonna show you right now is related with rs links classic get gateway so with rs links you can go in dd dd opc and create a new topic so i had one topic here but i'm gonna create just one and in this way you can see uh step by step how can i do that so let's create a new a new top configuration and after that you need to choose your plc and the network in my case gonna be 10.10.52 .10 this is the plc that i'm online right now this is the 5 slash 05 and i'm gonna choose this one here okay and after that hit done or hit apply okay yes and done all right so now i'm gonna go to the keep clipboard copy dd to link clipboard and you can choose what tag you can move to the excel or the csv file this is the the the, the talk that we created and now we go we, we need go online go go on online and in my case here i'm gonna choose the f8 f86 because i know this is the tank level so i'm gonna choose this one and i will see in the csv file all right so let's open the excel spreadsheet and after that okay create a new one and what you need to do is the right click paste paste special paste link cop yeah paste like a link and hit ok paste link and hit ok you can see this is the value for the f8.6 right so let's go to the um, the plc and the, i i will i will change the this f8.6 this is the tank level for my plc program and Okay, let me figure out where is this is. Okay, it is there. So right now is 45.9. I will I will change for 26.9. Let's see. You see, and the CSV file you can see the update from the PLC. So this is another way that you can we can do everything that we 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 want to do here in the CSV file. So these are the two methods that i'd like to show you i hope you enjoy a lot with this and subscribe on our channel and give your comment leave your comments and see you the next video thank you for watching bye